Yo, so this is the fun part. We get to uh, registering the battery. So first things first, make sure your interface is connected properly. Cable is connected well, both sides, the, 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 the car end and the machine end. And what we do is you put in the key fob, then you switch on your ignition, not start the car, just switch on the ignition. Then to, um, <coughs> like usual, to verify if there is a proper connection, you open IMPA and you should see these two black dots. The battery is being detected and the ignition is being detected. So we are connected uh, properly. We can exit IMPA and get to Easter. Just changed out the battery so um, it needs to be registered. So I'll be using Easter. Okay, so once it finishes uh, loading up, just make sure that um, sorry, just make sure that your <coughs> your connection is is, is is okay. You're using the 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 IMPA cable. Come to this uh, little wrench. On the settings thingy, uh, come to this VCI config and make sure it's on Diabas default settings. Diabas uh, So we are good. Click OK. Uh, you can you, you you can choose to type in your your car's VIN number, or you can just click read vehicle data so that it um it it. It, it, it detects on its own. Click on uh, complete identification. Then it starts getting information from my computer box. Uh, I see it starts um, uh, populating. Um, this is my VIN number. It's a real, real drive, three series, E90, blah, blah, blah. So it's getting all the information it needs from, from the car's computer box. And once it, it it's, it's done it to show you the control unit tree all the the control modules that are connected to the car uh, just let it do what it has to do then we can get to registering our battery okay now it's downloading um, this is what you do to register your battery you come here to vehicle management okay so you come up you you, you choose this its body so I click twice, but when you click body, this is the list that comes. So you want voltage supply, then uh, battery, then register battery replacement. <coughs> click start switch. Uh, register battery exchange. Um, so you, you you click register battery exchange then it, it it shows you this information you can read out all this data uh, on what you need to do it will tell you all the information you need to know about your battery placement um, so you can also see the, the battery exchange history when it has been uh, like when 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 it was changed out and when it's due for the next change so on this car the battery has never been replaced this is the battery that i took out and zero kilometers for the last battery change because it has never been changed and second battery there is nothing for the second the third and the fourth but um you will see once we once we, 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 we register our battery that all this change. So uh, we come to register battery exchange. Click next. Then um, if you are if you've changed out with the same battery capacity, you click uh, you choose this first option enter battery exchange with same capacity, enter battery exchange with higher or lower capacity. This is my option. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm checking with this one.
you select um, enter battery exchange for if you have changed the capacity because the one I've uh, put in is a hundred amp hour whilst the one that was in was a 55 amp hour so uh, I will choose uh, higher or lower capacity because capacity has changed click next um, tells you some information if battery with high cap lower capacity in an event of a change from a normal this button must be registered. What, 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 what? Click next. Is this as the newly installed battery an original BMW part? Choose no. Click next. Then it starts registering. Battery exchange is entered, and you should do it that the battery exchange is successfully entered in the DME. So this is done. Uh, that's how you register your battery. So remember to subscribe and like the video. Thanks for watching.